Hey Bug Geeks, uh, I'm just going to show you a little video of how we pack tarantulas here, uh, Beverly Bugs, um, just with the standard next day shipping. Got a lovely little one here, Kilobrachis Cane Kraken. Um, should be quite fun to pack. Um, I collect a lot of Kilobrachis myself as I, I do really find them interesting. The sorrel, burrowing type tarantulas, heavy weathers, full of attitude stupidly fast um they're really fun to keep but the um the trouble is when you've got to pack them or when you've got to rehouse them or something like that i don't take any risks with them whatsoever you just do it the easiest way really uh, i'm probably going to be scratching my head a little bit how to get this one packed but just bear with me um and hopefully you can learn something as well today um so without further ado, I'm just going to try and get this one now. <clears throat> she might go in that tub, she might not, but it's possibly going to be the easiest way first to get the container inside the tub and try and get her to go in there. So obviously um, we'd normally use kitchen roll or something like that just to cushion the inside of the tub as well. So it's only a small tub. She might like it, she might not, we'll, we'll see. Um, so I might be a bit quiet while I'm concentrating. And get that all packed out nicely. <clears throat> Basically, you're just trying to create a sort of cushion while they're in transit. They're only in transit for a short while, just overnight. Um, we have a 40 hour heat pack as well already in the box. Um, even though it's a 24 hour shipment, um, just in case they run into problems or anything like that, we just we always use the the forty hour ones. <clears throat> she's quite a big spider, so she might not. She's just come out of the burrow a little bit there. She might not even fit inside this, but um, we'll see. We'll see the troubles I have. <laughs> Kale rackets are a funny one. It's with a lot of the Africans are just mainly, I wouldn't say aggressive, but I'd say defensive, and they'll just go into a fret post straight away. So you can easily deal with them. But with Kale brackets, what I found is they're so unpredictable. Um, they're either going to run, or they're going to stand and fight. Um, I don't know which I prefer to be honest, <laughs> but um, we'll we'll see how she is today. So we've got the inside of the tub all cushioned out. <clears throat> At the moment, she is shying away. Beautiful spider, big black Kilobrach is one of the cane kraken is one of the largest uh, species of Kilobrach is. We do get seventeen centimeter, maybe even up to twenty centimeters. Some of them I do have quite a large one at home. Um, one of the lesser seen type spiders, but when she does come out, she is absolutely stunning. So all I've done there is just I pop the um, the container inside the tub and all I'm going to do is just try and work this for a, to get her to go inside it there. Nah, she's just trying to go into a burrow. <clears throat> This one is going to be quite tricky. <clears throat> There's lots of different methods that people use. It's just being in here or if I was at home, I'd do it in the bathroom in a large area where if she does choose to run, then it's in a big clear opening, but with somewhere like this with racks on either side of all angles, it'd be an absolute nightmare 
to try and find her if she did um, if she did get out. So we're just using the, the safest method which sort of works for me. She's been a pain. And it looks like she's gone in. And she's in. Well, that was a lot easier than what I actually expected. <clears throat> I do expect them to give you a little bit of hassle, but she was quite nice with the brackets. So always label the pot up. Always take the lid on as well. Uh, I've never had anything escape in transit, but there's always a first. Like I say, there's there's no point taking unnecessary risk. It's one you could harm me to answer. Two, you could seriously hurt yourself. Three, you could lose it, and this is not one that you'd want loose around your house. It's an old wild species from Asia, so with particularly potent venom, it's not going to kill you, but it will ruin you someday if it tags you. Um, so what we're going to do now is just pack the box. <clears throat> Full recycled newspaper. Like I say as well, there's a 40 hour heat pack in there already. I'll place that near the heat pad, but obviously not directly on the heat pad <clears throat> so the box is nice and full Do excuse the mess today, I've never been packing orders. Quite a bit of the day. We had a really big cold spell last week, so we've held back shipping a little bit. So it's quite messy in here from just packing an insane amount of bits and bobs. And that's it basically, I'll just put the uh, receiver's name and address on there. Brilliant. Cheers, guys.